Hey, my darling divas, Terry J coming to you from Dime Store Diva TV. Tonight I have a review for you on a really neat product that I picked up from EyesLipsFace.com, and it is the Elf 18 piece uh, limited edition eyeshadow palette. And this is what the packaging looks like. Um, you can see all the colors right here, and it comes with an eye definer brush. Uh, which is very interesting and I did use it today I've got it all over my eyes and I must say it's really really nice the palette is very very sturdy although you can see it's already picked up some printage um, from my heavy use of it today when you open it up it's got this gigantoid mirror just gigantoid and um, the shadows look like this and the brush looks like this and it's not a bad brush um i definitely used it i definitely will use it i don't have a problem with it these eyeshadows are oh boy the mirror these eyeshadows are i would say a great 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 alternative to maybelline the nudes or nyx nude on nude um, I almost bought the Maybelline one and then I thought I looked at a lot of youtubers reviews on them and and I just didn't get an overall feeling that um, that it was anything that I needed however this was in the back to school special and I got it 50 percent off it goes for eight dollars which is still a great deal uh, and I got mine for four dollars okay so with my twenty dollar order uh, I got free shipping and two dollars and sixty one cents off something like that it came out to be very good but I'm re reviewing these products for you not doing an unboxing of my my order because I really want to tell you what they're all about um, these shadows are mica based so these are going to go in my kit for bridal work um, they are good. They are very good quality. Um, mica is the first ingredient in them. We're being taught in school to use shadows that contain uh, mica as being their top ingredient. So rather than talc. So um, I'm going to put this in my pro kit and um, just leave it leave it be there. Um, I think it'll be really nice for doing bridal looks and and so forth. Um, so yeah, um, that's it about this. I do have swatches for you. I'm going to put up at the end of this vid. So divas, thank you. Uh, face of the day, just did a neutral, you know, sort of soft cut crease, um, you know, very typical. But I wanted to really check these shadows out. I used uh, Too Faced Shadow Insurance as my primer because Emily Noel 83 did a battle of the bases and um, I don't I forget what it was called but it was like battle of the primers or whatever and it did turn out that Too Faced Shadow Insurance gave the most vibrancy uh, of any of the primers that she tried even UDPP so um, which I own and and Mary Kay and 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 Wet n Wild and and a plethora of other uh, color bases so um, yeah and the next base that I showed you in that tutorial so anyway yeah um, it's a beautiful palette it was rated five stars by four people on the website I said it's a neutral palette but you know what I've got things to compare it to I wanted to see how this compared and with the ingredients being what they are it's a very high quality eyeshadow Elf um, is putting it together. They're charging a little bit more, but I have to say this packaging is very, very sturdy, very travel friendly. It's not going anywhere on you, and of, of course, it does include a brush. So, mwah, I love this. I will uh, put the swatches up for you at the end of the vid. In the meantime, divas, remember you've been fearfully and wonderfully made. You are a work of art, and I heart you. Until I see you in the next video. Mwah.